went to the, uh, my father took me to my first match in Minneapolis and I, I watched the show, I, got re I really liked it. And then I realized that the ring had to be set up every Saturday. And I all these guys that I grew up with as a young boy, I ended up wrestling. And every match I had with every wrestler, I always took something home with me. Mm. Baba, okay. Giant Baba, that, that was a fabulous experience. I mean, uh, Japan has rings that are as hard as concrete. And I learned the first night not to grab a headlock, because everything out of a headlock, I got suplexed. I got suplexed so many times, I was goofy. When you're in the business for 30, 35 years and you, you, get, you get sick and you, you stop working, you get better because you, you can't do what you used to do and some people don't want to bring you back and use you. And when Gene died, uh, only, uh, bottom line was only Gene together were great. He fought for uh, the guy's rights and he just, you know, pissed him. He just pissed off Carlos Colon over there and they killed him. Right. And uh, it was sad. Well, the Texas are? Yeah, Bob Orton and I uh, traveled a lot together, and uh, we would leave Dallas to head up to uh, San Antonio, and Bobby was just learning how to play golf, and I was learning too. And on the way to San Antonio, we pulled the, road, the car off on the road and shoot golf balls across the highway over Greyhound buses and cars, huh. and we didn't give a shit. We were training. You got hurt. You hurt yourself. Right. And if you hurt yourself, you, you're stupid. And I, uh, my hand goes up because I was stupid. I hurt myself one time with him. He went to give me an ass bump, and I just drove my legs as hard as I could into the mat, and I blew my knee right out. A little bit, then a bigger bit, and then it was about that size. And when I scooted out of the ring, I grabbed Sherry's arms, and I pulled her right up behind my ass. <laughs> and I said, we're marching to the dressing room. And I said, if you even move, I'm taking your clothes off. Right. And we marched to the dressing room and the guys were just laughing their ass off. I had a stain about five inches in diameter. Huh. And I mean, I, 